Hey guys, it is a new week of What's For Dinner, and if you have seen my last video of What's For Dinner, you will see that we had the same exact thing that I am showing you right now. This is leftovers. It is the whole chicken that we cooked in the crock pot with that Chinese seasoning, and then I cooked up some more zucchini in the oven with just some garlic and onion powder. Super yummy, healthy, and this is what we're having for dinner tonight, and we will see you guys Monday. Hey guys, happy Monday. We are having breakfast. This is our tried and true, and we are having eggs, bacon, and hash browns. And it's always good, never gonna doubt that. Jared makes like the best eggs in my opinion. So we are going to eat this and then we will see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so it is Tuesday and I wanted to film this. It's super early in the morning. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning. Well, I guess it's not that early. But I went to Fresh Market and I got the meal deal and I wanted to show y'all real quick. So this week is the chicken parmesan. It actually ends today on Tuesday, but y'all won't be seeing this till next week. But... Next week is burgers. I think when I post it on Monday, you'll have Monday and Tuesday to go and get the burgers. And then it starts over on Wednesday. But got chicken parmesan. Haven't had it in forever. I wanted to show y'all what all I got. And it gives you a list already right here. But let me try to take this out if I can with one hand. All right. So... Here is the, they kind of slid a little bit, but here's the chicken parm. It's a four pack and this was only $20. So don't, everything you see here is probably going to be added up to like $40. But since it's a meal deal, it only cost me $23 total. So we got the four pack of chicken parm. And then you get a four count of sliced chocolate cake. There's also um, vanilla. So we got that for dessert, and then it came with some salad. So this is the Sweet Baby Green and Red Romaine. They also had the garden salad, and they had a spinach and arugula salad. You can get cheese. They had mozzarella and Italian. And then I picked up the pasta. I don't like spaghetti pasta, but you can pick between spaghetti. They had ziti, and then they had some kind of like macaroni looking ones. So I got the uh, penne one. And last but not least, you get to pick between three sauces. So I got the pink pesto pasta sauce. There was also regular marinara sauce, and then there was vodka pasta sauce. So yeah, you guys, this is everything that I got for $20. So I got the cheese, the pasta, the chicken. I got a dessert. I got a side salad and some marinara sauce. So yeah, I just wanted to show y'all this really quick because I absolutely love the meal deals at Fresh Market. I try to get it as much as possible. And yeah, so I will show you guys the results later on tonight. All right, you guys, so this is the end result of the Fresh Market meal deal, the chicken parmesan. So we have the pasta, then we have the chicken that's underneath because I did pasta and then layer some sauce on it. Then we have the chicken, and all you do is just pan fry it for three to five minutes on each side, and then you're going to throw it in the oven after you put a layer of sauce and cheese on top. Throw it in the oven on broil for three minutes just until the cheese is melted and you have a temperature of 165 then we have a salad i haven't got the dressing out yet but we have the salad and then if you saw we do have dessert which is the cake so this is what our yummy dinner consists of and like i said this was only 20 dollars. so whenever this meal comes back around i advise y'all to go and check it out if not then Make sure you check the website every single day, or not every single day, once a week, because it changes every Wednesday. So we're going to dig in, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Hi, you guys. So it is Wednesday, and I am going to be showing you what I'm going to be cooking. 
And this recipe or version of this recipe I'm getting from one of my sweet friends on here. Her name is Kayla. She has a YouTube channel called The Unmodern Millennium. Absolutely love her. I have linked her stuff down below before in the last video. And I will link them again. But she did a slow cooker chicken noodle soup. And... It's actually 5 p.m. right now, so we are going to be doing a, like, 20-minute <laughs> pressure cooker for chicken noodle soup. We'll see how that goes, but I have the ingredients. I'm not going to show you because I have to turn around, but there's onions chopped up in the other cutting board, and I have celery, carrots, chicken broth is unsalted, so we will be salting it. I have some spiral noodles that we're going to use, chicken she used chicken breast. I'm using chicken thighs because that's the only thing that I had in my freezer. So we're going to use chicken thighs. And in seasoning, we have the salt, black pepper. We're going to add garlic and more onion powder because I absolutely love onion powder. So we are going to pull all this together and I will show you all along the way. All right, celery and the carrots are in, and now we're going to grab the onions and throw that in. All right, onion is in, and now we're going to put a whole thing of chicken broth, or at least we're going to cover it. She used um, chicken bouillon because she didn't have any chicken stock, but I did. And then she used celery salt because she forgot to get celery because she thought she had some in her freezer, but... um. She used that, which is perfectly fine. You can do that. We're going to stir it just a little bit before I add the seasoning. So that looks really good. It's a lot of veggies that I don't eat, but it's fine. That's why I have Jared, because he can eat all of it. All right. All right, seasoning-wise, we're going to put... This is onion powder, which I absolutely love onion powder, so we're going to add... A lot of it. Okay. And then black pepper. That's good enough. It's a lot. And then we're going to put some garlic. So that should be good enough. Now don't freak out. Maybe people will think this is a lot. But this is about one fourth full maybe. So we're just going to stir that up. It smells really good with all the seasoning and stuff. So, And then last but not least, I'm going to put salt. But it's actually, I have to use both of my hands. And I only have one hand right now videoing. So I'm just going to use the Himalayan pink salt. to add that. And then we are going to put it on 20 minutes on high pressure. And it should be really good. And then I'm going to boil the spiral noodles. And that's about it. And I'll show you the end results. Alright you guys. So this is the result of the slow cooker but pressure cooker uh, chicken noodle soup. So we have the noodles at the bottom that I just boiled in some water. And then this is the end result of the pressure cooker. And I shredded the chicken. And there's the carrots and the celery. It smells really, really, really good. It does. I'm just a little scared of the celery and the carrot because I really don't eat those. But, you know, I'm going to try it. And we'll see how that goes. And yeah, so this is our dinner. And we will see you guys tomorrow. Also, also, make sure that you go and check out Kayla's channel. It will be linked down below if you want to follow the recipe. So go over there, follow her step by step, and it will turn out great. Hey guys, it is, I lost the day. It's Friday. I've been sleeping all day. Um, we are having leftovers. It's going to be the chicken parm that we got from Fresh Market with the pasta. I just reheated the chicken in the oven. Yesterday I did not film because we went out to eat for my brother's birthday, which is today, but I had to work, so we celebrated it early. We went to the casino and ate over there with some family and friends, so this is at dinner tonight, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, it is Saturday, and it's going to be super simple because I literally just woke, as always, because I'm working. Um, Jared roasted some chicken thighs for me so he seared it off in a pan and then finished it off in the oven it smells absolutely amazing 
This is my favorite dinner, one of my favorite dinners. And then we had the leftover zucchini. Everybody knows that I love zucchini. So how to heat that up, eat it before it goes bad. And then I had some crystal hot sauce because crystal hot sauce is the only hot sauce that should be in your life. <laughs> But it is Saturday, so this is the end of the What's for Dinner. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Let me know what y'all are going to be cooking this week. I try to let, I try to do something a little bit different, showing y'all some of the cooking and everything. But make sure you go and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you go and subscribe to Kayla's channel. Also, her link will be down below. And I will see you guys later with a, another video. Bye.